Hi, I'm John Manito, Director of Tech Support at Meyer Sound Laboratories in, from Berkeley, California. Um, at ISC, we have uh, our Cal loudspeaker. We're showing a Cal 64 on the booth. It is a, a very unique uh, column array. It took many years of development to be able to create a column that was very well controlled in terms of its energy with a very flat phase response. Um, the result is that we can direct energy in a very specific area. Uh, we can steer it in one degree increments, uh, up or down uh, in the vertical, and we can spread it in five degree increments up to 30 degrees from a very narrow five degree. Um, the result is, is that intelligibility is over the top in terms of clarity, uh, coherence, um, and it ends up in very difficult spaces like the Music of Rhine, the uh, Symphony Hall in B Berlin, um, and the Concertabau in Vienna. Um, its intelligibility kind of sets it apart from a lot of other column arrays. As a, um, you know, as a, as a loudspeaker that can do both speech, music, um, and uh, put intelligibility into really specific areas that are t tend to be very difficult to achieve high intelligibility. It makes it kind of a unique product in the industry to, and a unique tool to be able to do a lot of problem solving in diff these difficult venues. Um, plus, architecturally, it's a, a loudspeaker that we did a lot of work on to make sure it works in both contemporary architecture as well as more classic architecture. Um, Okay, this is our compass control software that uh, allows us to control the beam angle. We can control the processing equalization in it. Um, we can store a number of different settings within the preset library. In the beam control, this is showing the angle that it's steered at this moment in this preset, which is three, which sits on the device itself. Um, it's steered down 29 degrees and 10, with a 10 degree beam spread. If I recall another preset, then it talks, it communicates with the device, with the column array, and it reapportions all the energy into different, uh, into a different beam setting. The Cal 64s can actually do a split beam, so it can do like a, a different beam angle and spread for a balcony versus um, a lower angle for potentially like a main floor of a venue. Cal also uh, has now uh, been AVNU certified. It's uh, AVB input as well as analog and NAES. The AVNU certification allows us to stream audio directly in from a network system um, that is producing AVB. So it can be on these on some very large networks um, and receive audio at high resolution uh, using the new AVB technology.